to a story you'll only see here on News Nation. The COVID-19 pandemic has affected both big business and smaller ones as well. Many having, having to lay off or furlough employees. For one snack company out of Arkansas, to stay safe, it chose to avoid hiring seasonal workers and instead offer overtime for its full-time employees. What began as a mom handing out holiday gifts and passing down recipes to her daughters has turned into a thriving business. Three decades ago, J&M Foods started packaging some tasty family traditions. When my mom came up with this idea based on her passion for food, my sister and I kind of thought she was crazy. When 2020 hit, things in this warehouse changed. So this snack shopping site had to adjust and adjust quickly. The first thing that came into mind in Scott's mind was how can we keep our team safe and keep doing what we love. The year's certainly been an adventure. In March, production came to a halt. But when things started cooking again, JM made a choice for safety and to keep its two dozen full time employees working. As we rolled into Q3, Q4, um, we talked to our staff and we all kind of looked, looked at it and said, Let's work overtime. Let's not let's not risk bringing in people we don't know, um, get an extra turnover, and risk having to take two weeks off as a whole company. Let's just kind of lock the doors, put up a wall around us, and and all try and do a little extra and get the job done. Rather than hire about 20 part-time holiday helpers, JM asked its full-time warehouse crew to work extra to meet the Christmas demand. I think it was fun for everybody for the first couple of weeks to get the overtime, but the fun of that is worn off. Um, everybody's, you know, it's everybody's getting tired. There's good and bad. Uh, the good is, is that they are happy uh, getting the extra, extra money, extra paycheck, extra money in their paycheck. Usually it's a Monday through Friday thing. Now you got to schedule uh, who's coming in Saturday, who's coming in Sunday. Can you work both days? Now this plan is working. Not only will those employees have more income for the holidays, there have been zero confirmed COVID cases at the facility and work hasn't stopped since March. It was terrifying and I'm so happy that we're almost to the end of the busy season and I know we have a way to go before the vaccination hits all around, but we've got a good plan in place and it seems to be working. With Christmas coming fast, this warehouse work continues. There's the light at the end of the tunnel. You, you can see the finish line. I'm going to finish 2020 as crazy a year as it's been just very grateful. A small family snack business choosing to stay small to stay safe. Now, they did tell me their bottom line will be down from 2019, but JMM is hopeful for 2021.